Hi guys, this is Sandy. I have something really important that I want to share with you because I know that this is going to help almost everybody who watches this. So it is something called Soleil water, which is really salt that is in water. And the reason that you need to be drinking it, and I'm not saying just want to, need to, is because it will remineralize your body. It has everything in it that is good for your body. God knew whenever he created salt that your body needed salt. Um, listen, water is number one, most important thing you need. And actually salt is number two. It is the essence of life. What will salt do for you? Salt will rehydrate your body. It'll help detoxify your body. It gives you energy. It naturally stimulates the digestive system. It promotes nutrient absorption. Salt is so important, but it has to be real salt. It has to be salt that comes from earth. It can't be that white salt. That white salt that we have table salt that comes in that little blue you know, container, that Morton salt, that is not good for you. So if you're using that, I highly recommend you don't <laughs> because that is not even real salt. That salt has been heated and processed and bleached. And then they took all the minerals out of it that your body needs and they put some iodine back into it. That's not salt. Listen, these kind of salt right here has 60 minerals in it and has every single thing that your body actually needs. So here's a pink Himalayan salt. This is a real salt. A Celtic salt is another good one. These are what I'm gonna use today. I'm gonna show you how to make this. It's called Soleil water and it is the easiest thing. I'm gonna make it and you're gonna go, that's it. <laughs> that right there is one of the best health things that you can do. It's gonna take your hydration game up like you wouldn't believe. You know, hydrate smarter, not harder. Um, but this is just a natural electrolyte that you can get straight from earth. Listen, this is what I think. When God made creation, he also made things in creation that would heal our bodies. And this is one of the things that will heal your body is salt. So if you're somebody that needs more energy, or if maybe you have muscle cramps or muscle aches, or you find that you're not sleeping great, or how about this? Are you drinking a ton and drinking a ton of water or whatever, and you either have to go and pee all the time, or um, you just feel like you're really thirsty even though you're drinking? It means your body is not absorbing the water. This right here helps your body absorb the water. I just think it's important for everybody to do. So I drink this every morning. It's so important in the morning because then it hydrates your body again after sleeping all night and helps detoxify your body again. I keep putting that up, I keep falling over. Um, anyway, in the morning or if you need more energy in the afternoon, you can drink it. Let me show you how to make this. So how do you make this Soleil water? All you do is need a glass jar. So get a glass jar. You don't want any kind of metal at all. The metal will react with the salt and make it rust. So a glass jar, and then you're simply gonna pick your salt. You need a good pink Himalayan salt or a Celtic salt or what I'm using and what I mostly use all the time now in our kitchen is this real salt. So this Himalayan salt is very good. It's got the color in it. You know with the color that it's really good. Um, but this, uh, it does come from Pakistan. This real salt right here I have found and so many people are using now and I understand why comes from Utah or we're here in America. So I'm gonna support things that are right here in America. So I purchased this right from Amazon. I get it on actually, get my pink old Malayan salt from Amazon too. But um, I purchased this right on Amazon. It comes straight to me from Utah. And I like that rather than coming from Pakistan, going to some place here in the United States, then getting distributed out. So I'm gonna use this real salt here. I'm using a coarse salt now. I think you can use a fine salt. I have not. I bought the coarse salt. Um, we have a, a salt shaker, a grinder, so we use the coarse salt anyway. But I also have the fine salt. Now all you're gonna do is take this and simply pour about a fourth of this jar full of salt. Okay. After you have that fourth of jar of salt, then you're just gonna fill it up with water all the way to the almost top. Make sure that you're using a filtered water. And then this is what it's gonna look like. You're just gonna take a lid, a plastic lid, and you're gonna shake it up. And that's it. You shake it up, 
You put it on your countertop and you leave it for 12 to 24 hours sitting on your countertop. And this is what's going to happen. This lid, I just took the metal lid that was on the mason jar. I took this off of a jar of mayonnaise and I put this on the top instead and put the metal one on the mayonnaise. Now I brought a glass of water out here just so I could show you how to do this. All you do is take, make sure it's a plastic lid because metal will mix with water and it will rust and you don't want rust down into your water. You take one teaspoon and you put it into your water. Same thing with the teaspoon is use a plastic one. So do as I say, not as I do. <laughs> because all I could do is find this one really quick in the drawer and my plastic one must be in the dishwasher. But I usually leave it out right beside of that. So use the plastic and then all you do is put your one teaspoon in your water. I use like 16 ounces. If you use eight ounces, you can, but it'll just be a little saltier. I don't mind the taste. I think it tastes good, but it's less salty the more water you have and then just drink it down and that's it. Now, if it's a little bit salty for you, you could just add some lemon juice and honey and that way it kind of masks the taste. And then you also have those other good ingredients going in your body too. Let me tell you what's so important about this. You leave this sit on your counter for 12 to 24 hours. So all overnight, it be, should be ready in the morning. See how this salt is down here at the bottom. You want to come in and see salt in your water still. If there is salt in your water, like this has been sitting on my counter for a while, you can still see there's a little bit of salt in it. I don't know if I can get the bottom without mixing it all up. And you don't need to mix it up before you drink it because it's already fully, um, the water has absorbed all the salt. So if there is salt still sitting in your water and there is the pink still sitting in the bottom of my water, that means that the water cannot hold any more salt. It's full of salt. It's the perfect amount that you need. So if you came back and looked at your salt and you have salt still sitting in the bottom, that is exactly what you want because it means that the water has absorbed all the salt that it can take. But if you come in and look at your water in the morning after it's been sitting out all night and all the salt is dissolved, add more salt to it because it means that your water was able to absorb more salt. So all you do is make sure you have salt in the bottom still, you've got the perfect proportion of salt for exactly what your body needs. Listen, God did amazing whenever he created salt because he knew that that held all the minerals that your body needs and it will, it will make your body function better all through salt because God gave it to us. It comes straight from earth. It's not that fake stuff. It's not the white stuff. And let me tell you one more thing. The reason I wouldn't use sea salt itself is because our oceans are very polluted now and so is the sky. So things that fall from the sky and how polluted everything is in the ocean, I just personally wouldn't use sea salt for any of my stuff. I use stuff that comes right out from earth and not off of the surface of earth with sea salt. Now, if you drink this first thing in the morning, it just helps detoxify your body after um, sleeping all night. So have your glass first thing in the morning. And then if you need a little more energy during the day, go ahead and do it again. Have a little bit more. It means your body needs some more electrolytes in it. Mostly with summertime, it's gonna help keep you hydrated more and it's gonna make your body function better. So cheers to more energy, feeling better and salt.